So hey guys, today is Canva Tutorial 101 Back to Basics. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and click that subscribe button, that notification button, so that you can get notified whenever I put out new tutorials on how to start making some money online, guys. Um, let's get the show on the road. You guys are awesome. Head on over to Google search, type in C-A-N-V-A and select the first result. So that's going to take you to a page that you need to sign up for a free account. And once you've signed up and activated it in your email, this is going to be your Canva dashboard. So just this, this is your Canva dashboard. This is where you can add an image of yourself. This is your account settings, your personal profile. And next you can uh, decide if you want to create a design from here, but I no one uses this option because you have all of these options here that you can choose from to create your designs. Next you have all of your designs tab. This is where all of your designs are going to get stored whenever you create designs. So you also have the folder where your designs if anyone shares a, des a design with you, it's going to get stored into this folder. If you have a team that uses the same account to create graphics and uh, presentations and what and so on, it's going to be saved in here. Your brand, you can you can also explore templates, other templates that people have created. If this is where you can access the Canva marketplace that you can buy templates and stuff from, you could create your own folder here and you can rename it you can name it to whatever it is that you want you can learn how to design they have cool tutorials they teach you how to design you can also upgrade your account and it's going to open up doors to a lot of cool future uh, features but you don't really need that if you're just starting out so you can get design inspiration you can see what other people are designing that you can get some inspiration uh around so up here you have the option to to create your custom dimensions sometimes when you want to create a uh, blog header a specific uh, graphic you need specific dimensions so this is where you can add your custom dimensions and then you can design a template of your choosing so now that we've covered that section here you have uh, pre-made templates that you can use to create your uh, Facebook post, Facebook cover, a uh, Facebook page cover, your YouTube thumbnail. You don't have to pay for that on Fiverr. You can come in here and create awesome uh, YouTube uh, thumbnails, your blog uh, titles. So let me just show you a few of my uh, designs. <laughs> I'm, I'm not a graphic designer. I don't know jack about it. I just put these like these blog covers, YouTube thumbnails together, and I create my YouTube videos and my blog post uh, titles. So let's go back to more designs. You can create a Pinterest graphic, a blog title, YouTube thumbnail, face, Facebook page cover, Facebook post, a blog graphic. This is actually uh, given to you into sections. You have popular design types. You have social media posts, documents that you can create, blogging and ebooks, marketing materials, social media and email headers, events, and ads. So in the uh, social media post section, you have Twitter posts. You can create an image for your Twitter posts for any social media uh, platform. You have your Pinterest graphic, your Facebook post, Facebook app. If you have a Facebook app, you can create images in here and it's all free. You don't pay. You have free templates that you can use and you can customize them, change your fonts and so on. I'm going to be showing you an example in a second. So you also have Instagram posts, Tumblr graphic. You have a uh, US uh, letter a presentation you could create presentations in here and then you can upload them to SlideShare it's also free so you have your common A4 paper style your letterhead magazines resumes certificates you can create certificates in here also 
You could create ebooks, desktop wallpaper, Kindle cover, and so on. You guys need to come in here and play with that. You could create gift gift certificates, labels, logos, business cards, food and drink menu. Uh, it's just uh, Pinterest is a really awesome tool. You can create um, invitations, wedding invitation, postcards. A lot of people create use Canva to create graphics that they sell on Etsy. So it's really cool. It's a really free, handy tool that you can use to create a lot of stuff. I really enjoy using this platform and I urge you to use it too. So let's go ahead and try to create a Einstein graphic. Because <laughs> I don't know Jack about creating graphics. I just try to put stuff together a lot. So once you've clicked on a template that you want to use, it's going to open up in a new window. This is where all the good stuff happens. Your first option on the side here tells you about the layouts. You can use any of these pre-made templates to create your graphic. Once you've selected a pre-made template, you could change the font of the template change that but because this a, a this is a paid template you could pay a dollar to use this uh, template that watermark canva watermark is going to stay on the image until you've paid for it once you go to download you're going to get an option to pay for the image in here you can change the font of the image let's say we want to change the font to something girly or something okay i want to choose that one See how we change that? You could change the size. You could change the color to whatever color you want to use. I made that into a yellow. That is kind of nasty. You could change the <laughs> where you want if you want to center it or put it on the side. If you want to use uh, small letters or capital letters. You also have the option here to change the spacing the line spacing this is not going to show because it's a one word it is a one word your letter spacing you could change that i don't know if it's visible to you guys you also have the option if you have like an element in here shapes a lot of cool options in here that you can use to create a lot of cool things okay so now that i created this uh cover board you can change the transparency okay so you see you can change that and then you can add your own text over that okay canva tutorial okay so i did let's just show you what this you can change the size change the text there is a text that I really like to use okay change that I want to make that larger okay and this is how you can change once you you can select the font go to more oh, I don't want the transparent I want the spacing this is okay this is how you change the line spacing you can also change the letter spacing it's gonna okay you can center your text change the color gonna make that into an awful <laughs> looking yellow you're not gonna be able to see that because that is just too much yellow and you could change the name of the design let's say canva tutorial so that you can find that i don't know how to spell tutorial when once you want to download that i don't know i think i know that's wrong okay so we've just covered layouts you have your elements section in here you, you have free photos you have grids that you can use in an image you have frames a lot of cool frames that you can use most of them are free you have shapes illustrations a lot of cool illustrations that you can use to create infographics your options are literally endless 
you can create graphs and charts in here really once you get the hang of it and you play around with canva a lot you can create a lot of cool stuff with this website you have all of these fonts in here that you can use pre-made fonts as well and they are free you can use this one let's say i wanted to go with that one i could make that large also okay i like that that is so cool you can change the I already show you guys how to change the color of the font so yeah now you have uh, these background options you can also change your background let's say you didn't have an image in here delete the image I also want to delete uh, the let's say I want to add a cool background to this okay I added this ugly looking uh, stripy background you can also change the color if you want to you can change the color of the background to make it look a little less you see that is kind of beautiful I like that <laughs> I'm an awesome graphic designer guys you gotta bear with me but that's kind of cool without the yellow no I think it's cool with the yellow so let's delete that and put this remove that delete that also so you see this is kind of beautiful okay it's kind of cool I like that I'm gonna use that yeah and then you have the upload section you can upload your own images into Canva let's go ahead and upload an image I'm gonna upload these towels I'm not gonna use them so let's say I want to add an image to this move that in the background I don't know what kind of a design is this anyway once you, you can upload your image and use that in here you can also search for images let's go for towels okay yeah I came with, <laughs> up with a lot of towels guys you can add that in here I'm selling towels would you like to buy some okay you can add whatever it is you want with canva you can do a lot of great stuff so once you're finished with that next you want to download your image you can change you can change the format if you want to download it in a jpeg format png which is recommended because you will be able to use it on all platforms you have the option to create a pdf and download this as a pdf a pdf print that you can print out with your printer and you can just download the image but don't forget to name your image because you want to be able to find it once you've downloaded it so this is the complete uh guide tutorial i don't know this will help you know how to use canva show you around the platform before you can go on to start creating some awesome graphics like i did so thanks for watching guys you guys are awesome as always if you have any questions if there is a specific graphic that you want to you want me to create a tutorial about please leave your comments below if there are any tutorials that you guys want me to make please leave them below and i am going to make them as soon as i can so thank you guys so much for watching you guys are awesome as always oh and don't forget to like and subscribe guys